Many people recognize Medgar Evers as a notable leader of the civil rights movement. However, not many people recognize his wife Merle and her activism in pursuing uh, human rights and equality. She worked alongside Medgar to open and manage the NAACP's first Mississippi state office and lived under constant threat due to that work. After Medgar's assassination, she moved to California but never gave up on pursuing justice for him, and in 94, 31 years after his death, she found that his assassin had been found and convicted of murder. In 1987, Merle became the first African-American woman to serve as commissioner on the Board of Public Works in Los Angeles. She founded the Medgar Evers Institute and chronicled her late husband's life work and civil rights struggle in Mississippi in a book called For Us, The Living, and as well as in the bestseller, I Dream a World, Black Woman Who Changed America. In 95, Merle Evers Williams became the first woman to serve as the chair of the NAACP Board of Directors. And Merle Evers Williams just lived a life so full of service, and we should all know the incredible tale of this woman. Check out the links below in the video description to learn more.